அனைவருக்கும் வணக்கம் வெல்கம் டு சதீஷ் சயின்ஸ் டீச்சர் யூடியூப் சேனல் இஃப் யூ ஆர் விசிட்டிங் ஃபஸ்ட் டைம் இன் திஸ் யூடியூப் சேனல் ப்ளீஸ் டூ ஷேர் அண்ட் டூ நாட் ஃபர்கட் டு சப்ஸ்கிரைப் திஸ் சேனல் அண்ட் ஆல்சோ ப்ரஸ் பெல் பெல் ஐக்கான் விச் இஸ் நெக்ஸ்ட் டு சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பட்டன் தென் ஓன்லி யூ வில் கெட் ஆல் தி நோட்டிஃபிகேஷன்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் அஸ் ஆஸ் சூன் இஸ் ரிலீஸ்ட் ஸோ ஓவர் வா ஓவர் கோயிங் டு அட்டன் தி டிஎன்பிசி எக்ஸாம்ஸ் ப்ளீஸ் யூ ஷுட் ஆல்சோ வாட்ச் திஸ் வீடியோ பிகாஸ் திஸ் இஸ் வெரி வெரி யூஸ்ஃபுல் ஃபார் யூ பீப்புள் so let's see the book back evaluations from standard 6 term 3 unit 1 magnetism science book okay so what is magnetism magnetism is nothing but the attracting property of some of the material over the iron material so that is magnetism so in this lesson they are giving the magic stone of magnets like the tendon natural magnets magnets are two types they are natural magnets and artificial magnets so the magnetite was the ore with attracting property found in that region magnets are natural magnets they are called magnetic stones so in the olden days the chinese used the load stones as the magnets for detecting the directions of south and north during the ship traveling like that Okay, let's see the book back evaluations from this version. So, magnets are natural magnets. They are called magnetic stones. Man-made magnets are also there. They are called artificial magnets. Substances which are attractive by magnet are called as magnetic substances. Substances which are not attracted by magnet are called non-magnetic substances. A freely suspended magnet always comes to rest in north and south direction. So you should remember most of the exams they are asking this point as a question. A freely suspended magnet always comes to rest in dash direction. Not south, north, east, south, east, south. Like that they are asking the answer is north and south direction. The end of the magnet that points in north is called a north pole. The end that points towards the south is called a south pole. A compass is an instrument which used to find directions like poles. That is the <coughs> north pole of one magnet and north pole of another magnet are like poles. They are repels each other. Whereas the unlike poles, that is opposite poles, north of the one magnet and south pole of the another magnet attracts the each other. Magnets are lose their properties if they are heated. or dropped from the height or hit with a hammer so if you have hit the ha- hit with the hammer then the magnet loads is lost its property the same way if you are kept in the magnets in the heated object or heat in inside the flame then it uh, the magnets loses their magnetic property the same way they dropped from the height also they loses their property so these are the points to remember okay let's see the book of evaluations choose the appropriate answer an object that is attracted by magnet is a plain pins because the piece of paper and wooden piece and eraser which is made by rubber all are not a magnetic material so the plain pins only attracted by the magnet <coughs> people who made marinus compass for the first time chinese chinese has only made the marinus compass by the load stones that is l o d load stones to detect the directions in the traveling over the sea a freely suspended magnet always comes to rest in the direction north and south magnets lose their properties when they are hit with hammer marinus compass is used to find the direction next is fill in the blanks artificial magnets are made in different shapes such as bar magnet horse shoe magnet and ring magnet the material which are attracted towards a magnet are called magnetic material so in the first uh, fill in the blanks artificial magnets are made in different shapes such as bar magnet horseshoe and ring magnet and some of the other types also there they are the cylindrical magnet and oval shaped magnet also <coughs> paper is not a magnetic material because paper never attracted by the magnets In olden days sailors used to to direction by suspending a piece lodestone lodestone is used to detect the directions by suspending in a water okay a magnet always has two poles 
the each and every magnet has two poles like north pole and south pole true or false if false give the correct statement section a cylindrical magnet has only one pole it is a false statement because a cylinder has two end so each end acts as a north and south respectively so the cylindrical magnet has only one pole is the false statement the correct statement is cylindrical magnet has two poles similar poles of a magnet repel each other it is a true statement maximum ion fillings stick to the middle of the bar magnet when it is brought near them it is a false because maximum of the ion fillings are stick in the polar region that means poles region only north and south pole region not in the middle region of magnet a compass can be used to find east to west direction at any place false because a compass can be used to find north and south direction at any place rubber is a magnetic material it is a false material, uh, statement because the rubber is never attracted by the magnets match the following so compass compass is a magnetic needle because they are attracted by the magnets attractions the opposite poles are attracted like no, the north pole of one magnet and south pole of another magnet attracts each other so the opposite poles are attraction repulsion the same poles are otherwise known as like poles they never attracted towards them so they are repulsion magnetic poles the maximum magnetic strength is found in the pole pole region only north and south pole region only not in the middle region circle the odd ones and give the reasons iron nail spins rubber tube needle the iron nail pin needle are magnetic material because they are made of ions whereas the rubber tube cannot attracted by the material um, magnet so it is in non magnetic material lift escalator electromagnetic train electric bulb lift escalator electromagnetic train all are used to displacement purpose whereas the electric bulb is used for lighting purpose attraction repulsion pointing direction illumination attraction repulsion pointing direction is all these terminologies are associated with magnetic material and magnets whereas the illumination is not linked with the magnets <coughs> So the following diagram show the two magnets near one another use the words attract repel turn around and to describe what happens in each case in the first arm a the south pole of one magnet the south the south pole of one magnet and the other another north pole of another magnet when they are come to close they they attract so the answer is attraction option b they are like pole south and south so they are never attracted they are in repulsion in the c option c north and south poles are closely together so they attract whereas option d they turn around and then attract so option e they repels because they are north and north are like poles here the uh, options f turn around is the correct answer and write down the names of the substances the substances attracted by magnets are iron fillings iron nail needle plain fillings and hammer whereas the substances not attracted by magnets are rubber band paper aeration wood chalk paste shoes scale wood and glass wood so that's all about the one mark book well evaluations from this lesson so go through it again and again then only you will get the familiar is of these answers so thanks for listening and do share with your friends and subscribe Satish Science Teacher YouTube channel thank you